R. I. Boy stabbed after staring incident. Stairs lead to slashed head. And the late Darren Ng, who was slashed multiple times at Downtown East after getting caught in the crossfire of a staring incident last year. These are three prominent cases of staring incidents that led to youth violence in Singapore. The most recent case of a staring incident gone wrong resulted in an R.I. boy being stabbed at Potong Pasir after being accused of staring at two other boys in McDonald's. We ask young people on the streets what they think of it. Compared to my time and this this year is a lot of difference. Like this year, there's a lot of this incident of staring, stabbing. The stabbing case, I think this guy, they really cannot think in here. They never think of their future. Then during my time, ah, it's just punch, whack. Ah, that's all in here. Last time is hit and run, but nowadays I don't know lah. Why need to stab, kill? Might as well they work for butcher, ah, go and chop some beef or what. At skate parks, it happens a lot, but basically it's just between how we block each other. There are fights where you know fist fights happen a lot in skate parks, and some they, they are sorted out. Yeah, I mean it's quite common in our culture, especially you know, like um, young people they like to do this kind of thing. But uh, my overall view about it is that um, it's a little stupid because there's no point in. In uh, getting flared up over something so trivial. Staring incident should be stopped in Singapore as uh, it starts. It、uh, it sparks off the whole anger in、uh, in teenagers these days as they have problem managing their anger. And I honestly think that、um, this thing should be stopped and be halted before it becomes worse. And gangs gang involvements play a huge role. Actually, I think in case of like people that you don't know, then looking at you, you feel awkward. Like. People look at you like this kind of feel like you can't do then look away from head to toe.、Uh, so from there, people will feel unhappy.、Uh. Does it happen between girls also staring incident? Um yeah, it happens also lah,、uh, but not as much as guys because we girls are not that aggressive. It depends on individual. It's either we get ourselves into a cat fight or we talk things out. Maybe of the they wear. How they wear, how they look at people lah, gangsterism lah, because I think ah,、uh. I think for guys right, they tend to feel weird. We personally, even we are standing at a different distance right, we still can see like someone is looking at us, and maybe they don't like the feeling of someone peeping at you, just keep staring at you. It looks feels weird, I guess. So they will just just stare back to like, why are you looking at me? Yeah, they kind of use the eye contact to give them a so called a warning or a, or just speak through the eyes lah. I would say without using like without really physically fighting first. Staring is actually it makes someone feel that you are actually、mm, judging them. They are probably just bored and looking for trouble. So I mean, it's kind of silly because I mean they are still young. They shouldn't just waste their life and like that. Fifty-year-old Dr. John Tan, an executive director of Children at Risk Empowerment Association or Care Singapore, tells us that the root cause of staring incidents could be pure ego. Perhaps the Teenage bravado years, where teenagers are full of life and energy and lots of time on their hands, like for example during school holidays where they hang out with their friends. So you're bound to have、uh, groups of this kind of、uh, people involved, and、uh, it's it's I I would think from my experience is also more of like,、um, you know, I don't want to be seen as、uh, inferior. So if your group and my group we Just have a glance, and that's considered a stare. And when we stare at one another, we don't want to be the one who backs down, because、uh, somehow that's associated with like I'm I'm a loser, I lose, you know. Therefore, I have in a way count out to you because you are better. Want to know what you can do if you are caught in the crossfire of a staring incident? Young Singaporeans give their take. All that in the next clip.